Hey Artland, how's it going? In honor of Earth Day coming up, I want to show you guys how to draw some different endangered animal species. And today I'm going to show you guys how to draw a rhino. Now, rhinos are definitely one of my favorite animals, and they're a lot of fun to draw because they have a lot of really cool details on them. So to start off with our rhino, we're going to start over here and we're going to begin with the eye. So I'm just going to start right here and I'm just going to make a little black dot for the eye right there. Then starting right here, I'm going to make a little line that just kind of curves above it and then kind of curves down to the side of it. Then right above it, I'm going to make a little line that just kind of curves up and down. Now, starting right here, I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve up and then I'm just going to go up and then kind of curve over like this, kind of like a really stretched out S shape. Now, right here, you want to make a line that's just going to kind of curve down and then it's going to go down like this. So you can see it kind of curves and then goes straight down. Then right here, I'm just going to make a line that's just going to kind of curve up and then it's just going to go up, down, and then up like this. Kind of just a little bit of a wavy line. Now right here, we want to make the mouth. So I'm going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve to here. And then right here, I'm going to make a line that's just going to kind of curve up and then it's just going to come around to here just to kind of form up the shape of the face. Right in here, I'm going to make a little curved line for the nose and I'm just going to kind of color that in. And then you want to put a little curved line right above it. Now let's add those famous rhino horns on here. So they're going to have a small horn right here by the eye. So I'm just going to make a little triangle shape that just kind of goes up and down. And then right over here, I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve up. And that's just going to come back down to here for their big famous horn. Now right here, we want to make the ear. So to start off on the ear, what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve up. And then I'm going to make it kind of pointy here and then I'm going to kind of curve out and then kind of come in. And then right here, I'm just going to add a little line that just kind of curves down. And then right over here, I'm going to add a line that just kind of curves up and then it's just going to kind of come down like this for the other ear. Now we want to draw the shape of the rhino. So we're going to start with his back. So starting right here, I'm going to make a line that's just going to kind of go up and then I'm just going to kind of curve down and then I'm going to kind of straighten out Then I'm just going to kind of curve up and then come down again. Now right here, we want to make the neck. So to start off on the neck, they have kind of like a wrinkly neck. So I'm going to start right here. And I'm just going to make a little line that's just going to kind of curve up to here. And then I'm going to make another one right here, a little bit smaller. Then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to kind of go down. And then I want to start off with their legs. So right here, I'm going to make a line that's just going to kind of curve in. And that's just going to kind of straighten out like this. And then I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve around like this. Then I'm going to take this line, I'm going to go in and then I'm just going to kind of bring it out and then just kind of curve up like this. I want a little bit higher over here than it was here. Now, starting over here, I want to make the other leg. So I'm going to draw a line. It's just going to go down. 
And then I'm just going to kind of curve it down like this, bring it right to this leg. Then I'm going to bring this line over to here, and then just bring this line straight up. Now, I'm going to line this up and I want to draw the stomach of the rhino. So I'm just going to start here and I'm going to make a line that's just going to kind of curve up to here. And then for this leg, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to draw a line right here that's just going to kind of curve down. I'm going to draw a line that goes out, kind of curve it around. And then I'm just going to draw this line. It's going to go kind of out, and then it's going to go in, and then it's going to kind of curve out again. Then starting right here, I'm just going to draw a line. It's going to kind of curve down. And then I'm just going to kind of do the same thing that I did with that last leg, just kind of curve up, and then just bring it right up to here. Now, back here we want to add the tail of the rhino. So I'm just going to start right here, and I'm just going to draw a line. It's just going to go down, and it's going to kind of come up. And then I'm just going to add a little line that kind of curves down, comes to a point, and then comes right back up here. So we have our basic shape of our rhino down. Now we just want to add a few details to make it look a little bit more realistic. So right over here by the mouth, I'm just going to draw a little line that's just going to kind of curve around. On the feet, I'm going to add the toes. So I'm just going to make a couple little kind of circular lines right around here. I'm going to make a couple over here too. And then I'm going to do the same thing on this one. I'm just going to put two over here. And then I'm just going to put two little ones right there. Then I'm going to add a couple little kind of curved lines right here on each side of the leg. And then right over here, I'm just going to add another one of those little kind of curved lines. I'm going to add a couple little kind of lines right around the eye. And then I'm just going to add a couple little kind of wrinkly little lines right here by the nose. And then right here on the horn, I'm just going to add some kind of long little lines like this just on each one just for some details. And then I'm just going to add a couple little kind of broken lines on the ears. And then I'm just going to add some kind of little broken lines for a little bit of detail, kind of going right down the side of the rhino. I'm going to add a little extra line right there. And I'm just going to add a couple little lines here. And I'm just going to add a few kind of curved lines right around the toes of the rhino. And there you go. There is your drawing of a rhino. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.